what's up pretty cocky crew i am back with another video i know it's been a long time since i've been on youtube but i'm back on and i'm back this time showing you guys exactly what's been happening and my progress throughout my new journey the building that i had before um the salon that I had before is just really down the street from you know my new location this particular lo location is a location that I treasure that I'm going to treasure if it I, listen it is so special to me because it is everything that I've imagined um with a salon office but I had a problem with the manager on the last location and that manager tried to basically during COVID suck me into a four year lease. And that wasn't gonna happen. Long story short, I told him that I wasn't gonna be renewing my lease. And now I am getting ready to open a new location. Like I said, it's pretty much down the street from where my other location was, but it's just, gonna be something that I've always really dreamed of having. I want you guys to walk with me through this journey. I'm gonna show you guys what's going on. I'm gonna show you guys how the building looks prior to me re-innovating the salon building. So Trent, what, what did you just say? You can what? We can live in here. You can live in here, but we're not. Y'all, these are all the boxes these are all the boxes all the new stuff that i had shipped and this is room number one more boxes but look at my hallway space my front area very nice this is the one room Oh, and let me just say this. Pretty cocky hair and beauty bar is turning into Pretty Cocky Studios. Yep, the name has changed. No. You proud of mommy? Sure. You got Show him your hair. He really wants to show. Oh, oh me okay so let me turn on the light so you guys can see yeah so let's, that this is going to be right this is right before renovations once again this room has a window you can see right out there okay Right on the busy. Let me look at that. Let me let y'all look at that. Up. Oh. Right on the busy road. Yeah. And room number two. Y'all, all of this carpet, all, all of this carpet is coming up. All of the walls. No, no to the wall color, everything. Pretty much everything will change. There's Jaden, y'all. That's my Jada book. So, y'all, this is my restroom, one of the restrooms. But this, this particular one, it's going to be some something special. But I'll let you guys know that later. So, comment below whatever. It says women. Yeah, it says women. But you should. Get this no, I, 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 don't tell them. I don't want everybody to know right now. But. Comment below whatever you think this bathroom is going to be. I'm changing it into something. So you comment below what you're, you think I'm going to change it to. This is actually the second restroom. You guys, I have a... Thank God for a break room slash kitchen. 
Yes, yes, yes. And this room will be something special too. And I want you guys to comment below on what you think this gigantic room is gonna be. Again, the carpet will come up and the walls will not, of course, be this color because I hate it. Oh man, he changed it. This room here will change. It's another room, he, he locked it. But that room will change. But that's another extension to my new location. So comment below please what you guys think it is. This is another room. Say hey, husband. Say hey, husband. Mm -hmm. I don't want curtains. No curtains. Why isn't there any Wi Fi? There's no Wi Fi in here. Why? It's, it's not. Oh, it's not together yet. I mean. Who, nobody is here, so why put Wi-Fi in a building that's not, that's not open yet? So yes, y'all, I am back at home and I just want to say thank you guys. Everybody who has supported me from 2000, I believe it was 14, 2014 all the way up until now. Thank you guys so much. It means the world to me that my clients have stuck with me this far through all of these moves. And when I tell you, um, those moves were not bad moves. It only made me um, get to the point that I am now. So I'm just grateful. I'm grateful for today. I'm grateful for yesterday. I'm grateful for my past, my failures, um, because it gave me all of the push that I needed to get to who I am today. And I have always stayed motivated because of that. And, you know, in particular, because of my failures, I've always stayed motivated. So to all the stylists out there who feel like they can't, you know, do something, whatever it may be, it's a lie. I mean, it's literally a lie that the devil has planted in your head. You can do it. Because in his word, he says you can do all things through Christ, which strengthens me. And if I did it, I know you can. So it's only up from here. And just stay tuned for all of um, my renovations. I'm going to be taking you guys through all of those renovations and um, look for the grand opening to my special people. My, my special clients in particular um, and my family will soon have a grand opening. You guys will see that on here as well. And y'all, like I said, I'm just grateful. I can't believe it, honestly. Um, it's just more to come too. I mean, it doesn't stop here. I'm tired as you can see. Yes, very tired. My bang is in my eyes. It's not curled, but it is what it is. Y'all, all I can say is keep it cocky. Peace.